Welcome to my C Sharp tutorial. I'm, today I'm going to show you how to use a checkbox to enable or disable a button. You could also do this to enable or disable text boxes or anything else you might want to have enabled or disabled at just a checkbox whim. So I created a form and I dragged a checkbox and a button onto it. On the checkbox, I set the properties. I just put the text, called it disable button, and the name is ch. X disable button. Now for the button, I just have the text called click me. I set the enable property to false, so initially when it starts up it will not be enabled. And I named the button BTN click me. Now I need to add some code to the checkbox so that when it's checked or unchecked it will change the value of what the button does. So I double click it and I'll go ahead and insert the code. I'm pasting it because I've already written it before. Basically, it's just two simple if statements. You got an if the checkbox is checked is equal to true, then we set the button enable to true. The other if statement is if the checkbox is set to false, then we set the button to false. Let's add a little code to the button to show that it works when it's uh, enabled. We'll just put a little message box in there. Okay. We'll do a remake of the Hello World here. Okay, so if we run the program, we'll move this down here. Notice that the button is originally disabled as we wanted it. When I click this, it now becomes enabled, and the Hello World works. If I click it again, it's disabled. I can't click on it. That concludes my C-Sharp tutorial.